All right, so we're going to start a discussion today of Augustine's Free Choice of the Will, Book One. I hope you've had a chance to read through it. Uh, if you have, you'll, you've seen that a major topic of Book One is evil. And there are three main subtopics regarding evil that Augustine and his friend Evodius, who's his interlocutor in the uh, dialogue, discuss. The first is the kinds of evil. So early on, they draw a distinction between evil doing or sin versus evil suffered. The second is the nature of evil doing or sin. And the third is the source or cause of evil doing. So what I want to focus on in this mini lecture here is the first main topic regarding evil. That's to say, Augustine and Avodius' distinction between evil doing and sin and evil suffered. All right, so let's get into the distinction between the two kinds of evil. So on the one hand, Augustine and Avodius talk about one kind of evil as being evil doing. Right? Evil that's done. Another kind of word we might put on that kind of evil is sin. And the other kind of evil that they identify is evil suffered. So they give several examples for evil doing. Some of the examples that they give are theft, adultery, Murder. They say there's you know lots of varieties, but these are some examples. And for evil suffered, uh, they talk about someone undergoing a, a punishment of some sort. Right, so someone they don't bring this topic up exactly, but you know someone put in jail is suffering a kind of evil, namely the deprivation of their freedom. So they also talk about God in relation to the two types of evil. They make a claim that God is not the source or cause of evil doing, or sin. And the reason for that is that God is all good, right? And he couldn't be all good if he caused evil doing. He, called, he was the cause or uh, source of evil doing or sin. On the other hand, God is a cause. He is a cause of this type of evil. And why? because he's good and just. And the idea is uh, sometimes that people deserve to be punished for what they do. And given that God is good and just, he gives people what they deserve. And hence sometimes he is the author of punishments. So, here are some things for you to think about. The first is, what are some other examples of evil doing or sinful acts? See, what's listed in what Augustine and Evodius talk about in the text are kind of categories of actions. You could give specific actions as, as examples that aren't generic categories of action. You know, well, when someone did this, right? Um, so so in, in that light, can you think of another 
particular example of evil doing or another category of evil doing? Lying. Lying. Good. Mm -hmm. So well, that's that's exactly right. Lying. All right. So you at home, wherever you are, what might be some other examples of evil doing or sin? What about examples of evil suffered? Can you think of any examples of evil suffered? I'm sort of thinking about when someone like might get sick or, or you know. Yeah, sickness. Like, it seems to be some type of bad thing that they're undergoing or yeah, evil yeah, suffer. Yeah. yeah. You know, you could think about someone, uh, I heard or I read a few days ago, I guess some, oh, no, it was uh, a video. People were boating. I think it was somewhere in Brazil. They were on, on a tour mm -hmm. and they're, you know, in this river or lake and they were looking at the the kind of mountains that, went up right against the water mm -hmm. and all of a sudden the the mountain part of it collapsed fell into the water i think some of the actual the rocks fell on the boat and mm -hmm. killed the people in the boat mm -hmm. this would have been being crushed by a landslide is a kind of evil suffered mm -hmm. i think yeah. right yeah being stuck in a house fire like what happened in new york exactly so you know again you at home Try to come up with your own examples of evil suffered. So in this video, we discussed Augustine's distinction between the two kinds of evil. One hand, we have evil doing and sin. The other, we have evil suffered. We gave examples of each. And we also talked about uh, Augustine's view on the relation between God and each type of evil. What we're going to do in the next video is look at Augustine and Avodius' accounts of evil doing or sin in particular. We're going to look at all the different theories that they consider, or the definitions that they consider of evil doing and sin, and we're going to see which ones they reject and which ones they land on. And, or which one they land on and take to be the correct account.